Good morning. So I told you all that I would let you know something when I knew something. And uh, I believe that I know something. Um, as far as I know, as long as nothing changes, Lord knows what all can happen in the next few days, um, I will return to service, if you will, uh, on the 31st. So I show that as being uh, a Sunday and um, that to give me a little bit of time. The reason I'm looking for time uh, is because, as you well know, uh, Christmas has just passed. Um, there are a lot of folks that got new computers, new VR headsets, new quote-unquote games to play. And, um, and so I will probably be quite busy uh, on the Facebook groups trying to assist people in getting their sim up and running. I've uh, already been trying to help a couple of different people. And um, that's something that I, I typically always do. It's something I, I just do. I, I try to be a use. I try to be helpful. I try to live by the motto, if you see a need, fill it. And um, that's, that's what I, I try to do. And so um, every day, typically, I'm trying to help people. Uh, in different groups and stuff uh, with te technical issues and what have you. Um, that's been ongoing for a long, long, long time. Um, but of course, right after Christmas, there's a lot more people that are having issues. And so uh, Flight Simulator is not the most easy software to run. And um, there is just a, a, just a plethora of problems that can happen uh, associated with different software, different hardware, just, it can be a nightmare. It can be a true nightmare. <clears throat> and one thing, uh, I, I know how it is uh, to get that really cool new toy, if you will, and, uh, and it doesn't work. And it sucks. It, it really, really, really sucks. And I'm not one of those people that are just good with sitting back and not doing anything, not accomplishing anything, not trying to help people, not learning, not not moving forward. I, I can't do that. I would be the most miserable ball of whatever uh, if I wasn't trying to move forward somehow. I, I, it's just, it's quite simple. When you, when you want things out of life, you have to, you have to work for them. And... One of the things that I, I want out of life is to see if I can help other people, see if I can help raise them up a little bit in any way that I have the capacity to do so. I'm not on this world for me. And I damn well am not going to sit there and just, everything's about me. What I want is to help people. That's, that's what I want to do. I've been that way my entire life for as long as I can remember. And so the next few days, I will be spending time, probably a considerable amount of time, trying to help people and um, help them enjoy their, their simulator. So again, it's, 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 you know, some people can install it and not have an issue at all. Everything straightforward works out of the box. But not everybody. Now, I've been working with a young man just this morning, right out of the gate. Um, have no clue. He's got a new computer, new to flight sim. He, you know, not very computer literate. Um, and it's just crashing. And <clears throat> so that's, that's, that's an interesting one, especially considering that everything's new. He, it's, it's not a matter of other software or anything like that, most likely. So uh, we're going to have to really dig in deep uh, to find out what's going on with his system. But, uh, and then I battle it too. Uh, I've had to battle with settings over the past week or so because Microsoft came out with an update. Uh, and it made my sim run so horrid. I think a, a slideshow is, uh, had, has better frames per second than, uh, than what my sim did. And it was the most, uh, in, in my opinion, uh, the most crazy fix that I've seen to date 
uh, and it was changing. You can choose between uh, DirectX 11 or DirectX 12. Well, I've had nothing but hassles with DirectX 12. Uh, it, it really causes the uh, simulator to perf uh, perform poorly, and I uh, had nothing but troubles with it. But out of any other ideas and suggestions, I went ahead and swipped, uh, swapped over. Swipped. I went ahead and swapped over to DX12. And uh, the thing smoothed out like butter and has amazingly good graphics and everything else. So that that's what it is. It's a, it's a never-ending battle when it comes to flight simulator. It's a labor of love. There's no two doubt, uh, no doubt about it. it. It's it's a labor of love. And PCs are something that I'm I'm fairly good at at working on. And so I'm going to try to be a use. And that's, that's what I can give to others. I can be useful. That's what I'm going to do. So unless anything changes, I will see you on the, uh, on the 31st. So hope you all enjoyed your holidays if you celebrate them. And I, uh, I'll see you soon enough. Shalom.